These new houses were erected following numerous dialogues between the Royal Papua New Guinea Constabulary, the National Capital District Commission and China Harbour Engineering, the company contracted to build the Gereu to Nine Mile Road. NCD Governor Poe Spakop explained that the delay would have cost the country 105 million kina. But fortunately, China Harbour Engineering was contracted to build the houses and that saved the cost. We saved that 105 million because we didn't keep the contractor waiting and uh, waiting for the houses to be completed. As you all know, we have awarded the Kora Way reconstruction extending to Four Lane Road to China Aba Engineering Company. The new houses are similar to the ones the families will be moving out of and cost NCDC 40 million kina to build. Half of that money was paid by RPNGC through the sale of the old houses. Deputy Police Commissioner Administration Rafael Luafolo said the construction of the new road is an important government infrastructure. This is a disciplined organization and welfare of our personnel is of significant importance to the morale and the well-being of our policemen so that they can actually perform to expectations. The new houses have three bedrooms with ceiling fence, a big kitchen with benches, a spacious living room, and a bathroom and laundry area. Head of NCD and Central Commands, Sylvester Kalaut, acknowledged NCDC for assisting our PNGC in building the new homes. The shortage in accommodation for police officers remains a nationwide issue for the Royal Papua New Guinea Constabulary. In 2014, the national government promised to build at least 10 houses for police officers in each district. Also in 2014, the national government partnered with the Red Sea Housing Estate and built 250 houses at Bomana. Those houses remain vacant to date due to utility issues. Tecla Gunga, National MTV News.